Yes, you read that right, the automatons are no more. After months of back and forth with the automatons, we have finally, finally beaten them. They are no longer on the galaxy map, and honestly, it's really weird to look at. Seeing absolutely no red on the galaxy map is so weird to me. However, the name automatons is still there, so perhaps they'll make a comeback, but we'll see. We're going to throw some theories out there. So yes, over the last few days, we have had the major order to take out the automatons. We've been fighting them for a couple of weeks, concentrated now and it's finally paid off with the automatons now being defeated the reclamation of the socialist automaton front is no more and our focus fully switches over to the bugs but is there something coming Yes, probably, most likely. There's no way that it's just bugs now. But for now, we can feel accomplished that we defeated the automatons. We worked our butts off. We concentrated on this front for ages. And it's finally paid off. Although I am a little sad that there's no more automatons to fight at the moment. Like, I can't switch up my playstyle and be like, oh, you know what? I feel like fighting robots. Oh, you know what? I feel like fighting bugs. It is just bugs now. We'll see how long for. I'm also a little disappointed because I didn't actually get to see a factory strider. So the gunships and the factory strider, what happens to those? Why were they leaked into the game for us to find if we were just going to beat the automatons? Was it literally just to scare us and perhaps push us back whilst we were so aggressive against them the last couple weeks? I have no idea. I have a couple theories though. Theory one is that the automatons are coming back and they are going to come back with bigger ships, bigger guns, bigger enemy types, everything. They're going to come back way stronger. Where? Probably somewhere different. Perhaps on a completely different front. That's theory number one. Theory number two is the Illuminate. I've been saying it for a few weeks now. The Illuminate are probably coming. Were the Automatons keeping the Illuminate back? Were they working for the Illuminate? There's a few theories out there. But if the Automatons are now gone, could that pave the way for an entirely new faction like the Illuminate? Just to double down on that theory, if the Illuminate do appear, obviously I've already said, like, what was the point of the factory strategies? What was the point of the gunships being introduced? Only for a few days, basically. If the Illuminate come, we could see Automatons mixed in with that enemy type or we get attacked from two different fronts from the automatons and the illuminate with the illuminate helping the automatons and everything which honestly is my go-to i want that to happen i want this to happen i want to fight two factions that are sort of allied with each other on two fronts because the whole galaxy war becomes way more interesting and way more involved as a community when we have to fight two different factions we're all having to plan what's going on i still think they need to add supply lines visible on the galaxy map for that to be a viable thing for us to do where we can sort of strategize with each other as a community and figure out what planets need to be taken first and what need to be taken later especially if this does turn into a three front war with one with the bugs one with the automatons and one with the illuminate and obviously theory number three is there's just an entirely new faction that we don't know about that could be coming into the game very soon we still don't know what those cloaked ships are they could be illuminate they could be automatons they could be an entirely new faction i have no idea what these cloaked ships are don't know why they were spotted there's too many conspiracies theories to go over on um, what's next now that the automatons are gone but it's actually ridiculous that there's an entire enemy faction disappeared from the galaxy map gone eradicated we won <gasps> But like I said, our attention has now pivoted to the Terminids. The new major order, which we have currently as of recording this one day and six hours to do, is to clear the way for the construction of new, safer, and more efficient E710 farms. And we've got to liberate Helmire, Astanu, and Crimsica. And I'm going to be honest, I don't think this one is getting done. To liberate three planets in one day, when Astanu is currently at 82%, Crimsico is at 36% and Helmire is at less than 1%. I don't think this is getting done in one day. So it'll be interesting to actually fail a major order after a flurry of successes with the automatons to the point where they're now gone. But honestly, I'm glad we're concentrating on the bugs now because after weeks of fighting robots, I need to shoot some bugs. I know I could have done it at any point, but I didn't want to be one of those guys that wasn't concentrating on the major order. I want to concentrate on the major order as much as possible so we can win. So I'm glad that we're now doing bugs again. Just shoot some bugs, have some fun. Fun. nice change of pace i hope that it's not too long before we see something new come into the game like a new faction the automatons coming back allied forces like the illumina and automatons sticking together and fighting us that would be super cool i really want to see that happen there's just so many possibilities with what could happen next now that an entire enemy faction is completely gone from the map it's once again just proving how good this galaxy war system and how dynamic it is it's just so good it's such an awesome way to do a live service game and it 
truly does feel like we've created our own story as an entire community. You know, every weekend we're having 300,000 plus players at once fighting against the automatons, fighting against the terminants, concentrating on planets, making sure that we don't lose planets, all this stuff. It's just so cool and dynamic. But yeah, that's basically all I have to say on the automatons being eradicated for now. Let me know down in the comments below what you think is coming next, whether it is the automatons coming back bigger and stronger, whether it's the Illuminate coming, whether it's both. Let me know in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching. Please, if you enjoyed this video, give it a like, subscribe for more Helldivers 2 content, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.